Hi guys, my name is Nichelle Turpin and welcome to my channel. Now today I'm going to be doing my nails. Basically, I, as a mum of three, I rarely have time for anything, let alone doing my nails. Um, I'm really into gel nails only because they last longer and I don't have to think about them for a while. When I was in Hong Kong, it's actually quite cheap to get your nails done. I used to go to this shop where it was about 18 pounds to do a full set of gel nails. And it was just, I don't know about you, but I just don't have patience as I get older. I just don't want to be sitting there for even half an hour, 40 minutes, getting my nails done when I could be doing something else as well, especially with children. So I decided to get my own gel nail set. Now all the links are going to be in the bottom description box so you don't need to worry about anything right now. I bought a UV nail thing and it's attached to a USB cord. So what I do is I have USB plugs in my house and I also use my laptop. It just, it gets power from the laptop. You can use, you know, whatever you have in the house that connects to a USB port. And I bought myself lots and lots of different color nail polishes. First thing you need is a base coat and a top coat. So these come in sets. Uh, so I got the blue sky ones there. So we've got the base coat and the top coat. And then I have, I'm into my browns and reds. I have a whole plethora of shades of pinkies, reds, light browns, dark browns. My feet are still pink from when I put my nail polish on before I went to Norfolk. So that's been a three weeks now and it's still going strong. So I'm not going to touch those. So I've connected the UV lamp to the laptop. As you can see, it's on now. The laptop's just over here. What I'm going to do is start with the base coat here and I'm just gonna put it on just like normal nail polish and take it from there. I haven't had time to file my nails, but obviously in an ideal world, you file your nails and you do it properly. I, I don't have time, you know, you could do a nice cuticle clean or something. So the, the set is done. I put it underneath. I'm gonna put it onto 90 seconds. I'm just gonna spin this around this way so I don't have to twist. So you can see. And then you just wait. You can see the nails, you can see them a bit purple and you can feel the heat actually. So you can see the lights, they're on, all the lamps are working, which is great. I've had this for about three years, so that's brilliant. You can see the nails getting done. Now I'm going to show you with one hand. I'll do one hand completely and I'll show you exactly what I do. So I'm just gonna pick a color now. It's nearly 90 seconds is finished, so that's done. I mean, usually it's still a bit sticky, so I add another 90 seconds in there. And then I'm going to now pick my nail color. So you can see the different shades that I have. They range from gray, dark, black, black maybe, to beiges, nudes. And then I also have my pinks as well, and my reds, and the burgundies. That's one set. I use those in the summer, and I also use the dark ones towards winter during Christmas time. And I like nudes for most of the other time as well. So now that's been done for 90 seconds. They're pretty dry. So if you touch them, they're quite dry. I'm going to put on some nail polish. I decided between two colors, which are these two. So, I mean, to be fair, there's really not much in it. I'm going to do the one that looks a bit more beigey. And there was the other one that I wanted to but I'm going to use this one. Now I don't know if it has a name, it just has a number, 314. I'm gonna open it up. Oh yeah, very nude, very browny. Just start applying it now. Oh yeah, perfect. It's exactly what I was after. I'll show you, it's quite thin layer now, and it's, you can, it's still a bit see-through. So this is after the first coat. So I'm going to put it in again for 90 seconds. I'll probably do it for about 180 seconds because I think about three minutes because I think there's quite thick nail polish, quite thick gel. 
so I'm just going to leave it on for as long as I can really. I'm in my baby's room today. I don't know if you feel this way as a mum, but we actually have got six rooms and I still have no space to myself. I literally, like the last video I shot, which was about my Louis Vuitton multi pochette that was in my son's room, and he he saw it and he was like, Mummy, why were you in my room? And I'm thinking, well, where where would I go? Well, why don't you go to your room? Well, that's because we don't have any sun in my room where there's no light. And he was just like, oh, well, Mummy, you were in my room. When, what time were you in my room, Mummy? And I was like, for God's sakes, I won't use your room next time, will I? At least the baby can't talk to me like that well, right now anyway. I'm just going to enjoy it as much as I can. That's 90 seconds done, and you can see it's still, it is quite dry actually. I could do another coat right now, but I'll just do another 90 seconds again. As I was saying, I don't use my daughter's room because her room's a tip. It's always a tip. No matter how much we try to tidy it up, it's always a tip. And I will do a tour of my house. We, we just had it renovated. When I say just, it was last year, but we're still decorating it. It's a mess. And uh, her room, she is, when they say girls are the messiest, girls are really the messiest. And I think my husband will say that about me too. In my baby's room right now, and again, there's no furniture in this except for two Ikea cupboards. The bed, we've ordered the beds, but they're coming. Well, his bed, it's a single bed, and that's coming in three months' time. And I don't know what it is with sofas and beds, but they just take months, literally months, a quarter of the year to come. So that's ridiculous. But I got the single bed because he's almost 13 months now. And by the time he's ready for his own single bed, he'll be old enough. So that's why I got the single bed. This is just done, it's almost done, 90 seconds is over. But I'm going to be doing another second layer. Start again. So you can see, this is after the second layer, it's looking great. I love this shade. Actually, you know what? I don't even think I've ever put this shade on. Maybe I have, maybe I haven't, I don't know. So I'm gonna do it for another three minutes. Just to show you how this UV lamp works, you do have three settings. You've got 30 seconds, 60 seconds, and you've got 90 seconds. So it really depends how you want to use it. I've always used it with 90 seconds. And if you, you just put your hand underneath it, as I've been doing, you just press the 90 seconds and it starts it off. It's great. And as I said earlier, I've had this for about three years now. And it's never let me down once. All the little UV lights are still working and it's been brilliant and I will put down everything that I've used and bought because I do recommend it. I recommend the, the polishes as well. I mean, to be fair, I might do the She Light, but I wanted, I just wanted to try different, loads of different colours and this was a lot cheaper. This was only about four or five pounds for six of them. But if I do want to, at a later stage, I might buy the She Light range because, you know, they are good. Or there are loads of other ones that are, that are out which are just as good as she like. So that's three minutes and that looks great. Should I do another layer? I'm not sure if it needs another layer actually. I think I leave it with just two layers because I do like it like that. I don't want it, you do also don't want it too thick where it just starts to peel off really easily as well. So I think two layers is fine. So now what I'm going to do, it's all dry because it's been three minutes and I'm just going to do the top coat now. But you can see, the LED lights, I think it's LED lights or UV lights, I don't know what it's called. It's reacting to the gel polish. You can see the color, so that's good. So it's making it set quickly and that's how it, it's activated. With these nail polishes, you can't just let them dry naturally. You have to use the, the UV lights. I hope you like my ring. So I bought this from AliExpress. I will be doing a whole AliExpress jewelry haul. I love AliExpress and it's a Chinese website. And I am actually thinking of starting my own jewelry business, but what I wanted to do was get samples, cheap samples, because I want to do high quality jewelry, 925 sterling silver, and it's gold vermeil plated instead of gold plated, which, which lasts longer and is better quality. I've been getting lots of samples of rings and lots of jewelry, so I will be doing another video on that. And then I'll be doing my jewellery that I got from Bangkok. There's a market in Bangkok. If you ever get the chance to go to Bangkok, it's amazing. 
So when I was living in Hong Kong, Bangkok was only about two and a half, three hours away. And I'd go, I've been there about three or four times now to Bangkok for the weekend. There's a market called Chattachuk Market, Market. And it's the biggest market you'll ever see in your whole life. And it's full of anything you'll ever want to buy in your whole life. And it's just amazing. I really miss it. Oh, I do. This is the time I do miss Hong Kong when you think about the shopping. But anyway, I bought lots of jewellery from Chattachuk Market too. And I'll be doing another, I'll be doing a Chattachuk jewellery haul video soon. It's just getting the time to do all of these things. You never have enough time really, do you? So now that it's done, you can see that's after two layers. I've just got some nail polish remover on there. And you can just see if you take them out, all completely dry. There you go. And that's what a, a hand looks like. That's not, isn't that lovely? I really like this actually. I love the shade. And I'm just going to go and do my other hand and I will show you that in a minute. <music> second coat with a top coat on and it's done and I only left it on for 90 seconds and again I've got the cotton pad with my nail polish remover and it's totally clear so it's there you go okay these are my hands these are the nude color and I just want to give you a quick shot of my feet that was done with number 312 in the light Uh, a yoga pose for you there. I hope you like my nails and thank you for watching. See you next time. Bye. Thanks for watching my video. If you like my channel, then don't forget to hit the subscribe button and also to ping the notification bell below. See you next time. Bye.